uh, how do Chinese people perceive India? Um, apart from recognizing India as the world's most populous country, um, they also acknowledge India's significant economic strength. Um, videos on Chinese media introduce the top 10 cities in India. Um, the 10th the place is Jaipur. Uh, Jaipur is a tourist city in India founded in 1727 uh, um, with its grid-like layout of streets and pink-colored ancient buildings. Uh, it is known as the Pink City of India and remains one of the most beautiful cities in the country. Um, Jaipur has a uh, population of 3.9 million and a GDP of 37.2 million. Um, according to data, Jaipur ranked 244th in the 2018 Global C500 as a significant city in northern India. Jaipur is not only famous for its woolen textiles domestically and internationally, but it is also a hub for the jewelry trade in India. Um, it is a city with excellent tourism and economic development. Um, the ninth city is Surat. Um, Surat is a port city in western India, uh, covering an area of 35.56 square kilometers with a population of approximately 6.38 million. Um, its GDP reaches 58.8 billion US dollars. Um, uh, it ranked 220th among the top 500 global cities in 2019. As one of the oldest cities, um, Surat has been a prosperous international trading center since the 14th century. Um, in the 18th century, it served as uh, an important commercial port and witnessed the rise and fall of Mumbai. Um, nowadays, it mainly relies on traditional small scale uh, industries and family handicrafts as its main economic pillars. Uh, Pune, ranked eighth, uh, is a city with a population of 5.57 million and a GDP of 60.1 billion. Uh, it is ranked uh, 195th in Global City 500 list for 2019. Uh, Pune is located in Western India and is the second largest city in Maharashtra. Um, it serves as an economic, cultural, and transportation hub for uh, the state, as well as uh, an important educational center. Uh, the Southern Command Headquarters of the Indian Army is also based uh, in Pune. Um, this city is known for its industrial prowess with numerous industrial areas in the suburbs. Uh, it is home to the renowned uh, Tata Motors. Uh, Pune has emerged as a significant academic and research center in India and is often referred to as the Oxford of the East. Uh, Ahmedabad, seventh largest city in India, is an important commercial port with a population of 601 million and a GDP of $62.9 billion. Um, it ranked 169th in the 2019 Global C500 list and is the sixth largest city in India. Um, Ahmedabad is the largest city in the state of Gujarat and a significant center uh, for the textile industry and transportation. Uh, um, located in the cotton producing region of Gujarat, it is the uh, second largest textile center in India, accounting for a quarter of the country's fabric production. Uh, Ahmedabad is also home to the world's largest textile museum and has emerged uh, as the second largest cotton textile city in India. Um, the sixth city is Chennai. Um, Chennai is one of the top 100 metropolitan uh, areas in the world, uh, located on the shores of the Bay of Bengal. Um, it is the fourth largest city in India, uh, covering you know an area of 130 square kilometers and with a population of 7.77 million. Uh, Chennai is known for being one of the most densely populated cities in the world. Uh, as the fourth largest city in India, uh, Chennai plays a crucial role in the trade routes of the Bay of Bengal serving as a key trading hub and often referred to as the gateway to South India. Um, it is a center for economic and cultural activities uh, where merchants from various places come to rest and engage in business. Um, in fifth place, we have um, Hyderabad. Um, ranked 110th among the 2019 Global City 500, Hyderabad is the sixth largest city in India covering an area of 220.36 square kilometers with a population of 8.7 million and a GDP of 8. Um, the people of Hyderabad are predominantly followers of Hinduism. Yeah, there's also a significant presence of Muslims and Christians. Um, it stands as a historic center of Islamic culture. 
and it is renowned as the city of pearls due to a thriving pearl industry. Uh, Hyderabad boasts a rich cultural heritage in arts, crafts, and dance, making it a captivating hub uh, of traditions. Um, in the fourth position, we have Bangalore, uh, situated in the southern part of India. Bangalore spans an area of 174.7 square kilometers and is home to approximately 10.5 million people. Uh, with a GDP of 98.7 billion USD, it secured the 104th spot in the 2019 Global City 500. Um, post independence, uh, Bangalore evolved into a significant hub for heavy industries. Um, the rapid growth of high tech companies transformed Bangalore into the epicenter of India's information technology, often referred to as the Silicon Valley of India. Um, serving as an nexus for technological research in India, Bangalore is home to esteemed institutions with a rich history, such as the Indian Institute of Science, Indian Institute of Astrophysics, Roman Research Institute, and the National Institute of Advanced Studies. Uh, the third city is uh, Kolkata. Uh, Kolkata is the third largest city in India, after Mumbai and New Delhi. Uh, the city has uh, a population of 15.72 million people, uh, and a GDP of $150 billion. Uh, uh, it is the largest jute manufacturing center in uh, in India uh, and ranks among the top cities in the world in terms of jute production. Uh, during the colonial period, Kolkata was the capital of British India. Uh, after India gained independence, it's commonly faced some stagnation. Um, however, from the year 2000 onwards, um, the economy started to recover and regain its growth momentum. Um, Kolkata is also a, a unique city with um, a rich social, political, um, and cultural heritage. Um, it has played a significant role in India's independence movement and labor union movement. Um, the Communist Party of India has been in power in Kolkata uh, for 30 years. Uh, the second is New Delhi. Uh, New Delhi is the capital of India and also the largest commercial center in northern India. Um, it is the national political and cultural center ranking 56 in the 2019 Global City 500 list. Um, uh, New Delhi covers an area of 1,484 square kilometers and currently has a population of 30.29 million, making it the second largest city in the world. New Delhi's main industries include, um, it is located in the southern part of Delhi, with only a Delhi gate uh, separating it from the old city of Delhi. Um, it is a typical radiating and youthful city. Uh, New Delhi is centered around the Connaught Place, uh, with its city streets radiating in all directions. Uh, Mumbai, also known as Bombay, uh, is a coastal city in western India. Um, it is the largest port in India and a significant trade center in Asia. Uh, Mumbai covers an area of 4,312 square kilometers and has a population of 25.97 million, making it the second most densely populated region in India. Um, it's also the wealthiest city in India, with a staggering uh, GDP of $224.8 billion. Um, Mumbai serves as India's financial hub uh, and is the birthplace of the country's textile industry. Um, it ranks 60th on the 2019 Global Cities 500 list in terms of overall strength. Um, additionally, Mumbai has a thriving service and entertainment industry, earning the title of India's commercial and entertainment capital. Um, the famous Bollywood film industry, the largest in Asia, is located in Mumbai. 